Hi, I'm Ron. I designed one of the original skid blades in 2018 and it was black, but I found this more aesthetically pleasing material. It's a simulated carbon fiber. It's not the real deal, but it sure looks a lot nicer. It's got satin uh, finish on the back and still made out of that the aviation grade uh, Kydex, which is a plastic, but it's virtually unbreakable. That's why they use it in planes and stuff. So let me show you how to install it. Easiest way to do it is to simply lock up your rear brake pull back on your handlebars and uh, lower it down. I use a dog bed, uh, but you could use anything that will protect the display. And now you can work on the bottom. All right, obviously these are the wires you'll want to protect, all these connections, as well as the sensor. So take your water bottle uh, mount screws that came with the uh, bike and start with the top screw. Start at just a few threads, and then go to the next one. Okay, I've tightened up the uh, two mounting screws. You can see one of the bumpers here to protect the wires coming out of the frame. And then you can see these bumpers. You want them to rest uh, ideally right there in the middle, but they might be a little slightly offset. We have two sets of holes. If you need to uh, remove these plugs, you can switch these uh, screws and the bumpers over to the other set of holes. It depends on what year you've got. Of rover then we're going to come back and we're going to use our zip ties and uh, secure it to the frame okay here's our, our first zip tie and you'll notice uh, where you want to secure it on the frame and uh, in front of that brace so it doesn't slide back and let's do the other side all right we've got uh, both zip ties on we've cinched it down you'll notice the bumpers hitting in the proper spot and if you look way down in here you'll see that the wires pass between the bumpers. That's what gives it protection. And then if you look overhead, up here, you'll see that the sensor, the crank sensor, which is very vulnerable to impact, is also protected. Okay, I put some duct tape on it just to protect the finish. It won't break anything, but it might get scratched. But I'll take this hammer, And you notice the Kydex, it just, it just bounces back. That's something you won't get with metal. Metal will bend and then you've uh, either contacted your wires or you'll have to straighten it out. But there's nothing that this thing won't protect, including the sensor that's covered up here. Anyway, that's it. Hopefully I've made it clear enough you can uh, install it easily. Thank you for watching.